Hello and welcome to more Pokemon! We're back with the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we got the third badge and we defeated the Battle House. Now, there's a lot of stuff between now and the fourth badge, so let's just go get to it. I think we just have to go up this way and start beating people up. So, we're gonna go and smash this rock and we're gonna go beat up these reporters. Roll camera. <laughs> They just want to record me beating them up, dude. Engineers Stu and Nick, two Pokemon, Ninetales and Farfetch'd. Kind of weird, this random trainer battle is level 17, even though we've already dealt with level 24s at the gym, so... The levels are kind of weird in this game. I'm not going to worry too much about being super effective, because we're just going to be stronger than them. Look at that, guys. I knew it was going to be a critical. I knew we'd kill him, even though it's not very effective. See? That was all planned, dude. I knew I was gonna freeze them. They do it all part of the plan. Time for an interview. What do we put in for the interview? We have a lot of options. Let's talk about our hobbies. Anime. I think I think our hobby's gonna be ball. Sounds good. <laughs> the answer is ball. What's your hobby? Oh, my hobby's ball. Wait, is that it? <laughs> That's the interview? Just ball? Now, guys, I gotta tell you something, all right? Last night, I bought a banjo. I've never played a banjo before in my entire life. I'll figure it out. Just give me give me a few decades. Oh, guys, I didn't even realize. Hotels is 29, which means if we use a rare candy, they'll get to 30. So, moment of truth. Does level 30 evolve us? Level 30 on hotels. Will this work? Yes, it works! Oh my gosh! What do we got? After all this time. Oh my... Why? No, can we go back? Can we please go back? Gosh... Dang it, dude. I guess I told you guys that all my Pokemon are going to evolve into bugs, and I was not lying. Now we just have to wait for Bunwiz to evolve into a bug. I'm calling it, guys. Bunwiz is going to evolve into Groudon. Just you wait and see. Wait, is this a new area? Can we actually catch something here? All right, guys, I I'll say it right now. If we capture an Illumise on this route, then I will play Banjo next week on an episode, even though I don't know how to play it yet. Well, only if it's Illumise. And we got ourselves a guy. <laughs> I got a gosh dang Nidoran, okay. Oh my gosh, stop critical hitting gosh dang it, Bunwiz. And we got him first try. What do we name Nidoran? That's the dumbest name I've ever heard. There we go. Let's go back. We're gonna try to level up this Nidoran. There's one level here. Let's go up here. We got Mr. Chimney. Yeah. Dude, speaking of salad dressing. Oh, crud, we got level 16. Nice. Yep, here we go, guys. I'm, t I'm telling you guys, it's either Illumise or Groudon. Let's go. The Walrus copy pasta? What, dude? Got ourselves a Walrian. Heck yeah. And we also registered some old dude in our phone numbers. Okay. So Ravioli is going to be a part of crew number three, guys. We've got ourselves the Fiery Path. So we can definitely catch a new Pokemon. Let's see what we got in the Fiery Path. Come on. Give me something, game. Anything. Hello? There we go. What do we got for the Fiery Path? And it's going to be a Ghastly? I mean, hey, it can evolve, so that's fine. Hold down that B. Let's go and catch ourselves a Ghastly. Yes? Yes? First try again? Gosh dang, guys. We are so good at holding down B. Well, what do we name Ghastly? I'm not naming him Fart Sauce. That's just weird. All right. That's his name. Oh my gosh. Look at Nuzleaf. Just look at him. She just called me adorable. Please, I need a romantic battle. Wow. Can you guys feel that? That's love in the air. Oh, dude, we're so dead. Come on, Budwiz. You gotta save the day, man. This is a tough Pokemon coming out. Dunsparce, the ultimate Pokemon. Dude, Budwiz, don't die. Okay, we're gonna swap just in case. I do not want to miss right now. Sacred Fire? All right. I'm pretty glad I did not send out Sir Pickle or something. Oh, he gets the burn. Oh, but he also gets burned. That's what you get, dude. There we go. We finally get to play the video game. Let's go for Peck. Get this guy finished off. Can we go beat up this kid? Yes, we can. Bring it on, dude. Man, this battle's taking forever. Gosh dang it. We get burned. And I miss. Come on, game. Stop doing that crud. I'm so upset. Keep getting burned. You know what, dude? I don't even care. I'm just going to heal it again. Cross chop. Hello? We're fine. Look at that, guys. We finally hit him. Yes. Okay, we got Whalmer coming in. I think it's time for some Vine Whip. And now that uh, Hotels is a bug type, our Vine Whip is going to be same type attack bonus, so that's pretty cool. Sometimes I like saying something that's really wrong just to <laughs> just to see if it annoys anyone. And down goes Whalmer. We got him. Take that, Weightlifter Zoe. TM43. Now we can make ourselves a secret base. Stop talking to me. Oh my gosh. Get out of here. All right, let's go take a look at what TM43 actually is. It is Bone Rush. What? Bun Whiz. 
Oh, dude, that's really good. Oh my gosh, rare candy, nice. Thanks, old lady, she healed me. In search of trainers. Hi, today I'm visiting an area near Route 111. We're trying to spot some up-and-coming new talent in the field. Today we turned our lens on the trainer Wahei 3. In a dominating performance, we were flattened, rolled up, and tossed aside. Wahei 3 is ruthlessly strong. The move Karate Chop is Clamperl and Rayquaza's sign of friendship. After our battle, we asked Wahei 3 for a succinct summary. The trainer replied, Ball. Wahei 3's Pokemon, <laughs> Clamperl and Rayquaza, and Ball. Mmm, that's deep. There's some deep significance behind that quote. It's no surprise. A good trainer has good things to say. That's all for today. I'm so deep, guys. Dude, look at her head. She's got a poop head. All right, guys, new Pokemon. Ooh, okay, I'll take it, dude. Okay, get the pickle juice. Got him. There we go. Hold down those bees. We're gonna go catch ourselves a Raichu. First try every time, dude. I think that's our third Pokemon today, and every single one has been first try. We're going to name this Raichu after a musical instrument. This is the best musical instrument I can think of. If you guys can think of something better, let me know. There it is, guys. We've got mayonnaise. Okay, with that done, we're gonna move on. We're gonna go crud everywhere, dude! Oh, do we have to fight this small child? No, no, okay. But we can go fight this guy. Scribe Joey with one Pokemon. That is a top percentage Magby. Oh. Get him, dude. Two swings. Down goes Magby. We're gonna go grab this item right here. We got some balls. And a smoke ball. I was not kidding, guys. An actual ball. What is your favorite Pika evolution? Oh, dude. Meryl, for sure. Raichu. I don't need you. More like bite you. I think we're... Crud. Is there anything inside this pile? Yeah. Oh. oh my gosh. We find a TM, but it's just Razor Wind. Oh, we're so close to the next town. I'm gonna read this sign. You can't stop me. Fall Arbor Town. I'm just hoping, guys, that there's one single bit of water inside Fall Arbor Town so we can actually catch something there. Well, it looks like there's nothing in here, but we do have Route 114 where we could catch something. Here it is, guys, our brand new Pokemon. Okay, it's actually Grovile. That's not bad. Come on. Oh my gosh, first busted ball of the day. Six great balls left. Let's try again here, guys. Holding down B. There we go. So it wasn't first try that time, but still not too bad at all. Gosh dang it, guys. I can't pass it up. That's too good of a name. That's too good. There it is. Furniture. Are you kidding me? Dude, get it out of my computer. She's blocking me. How could you do this? Darn it, Lanet. This is not a land party. Get out of here. Thick fat. Dang, he's thick, boy. So I guess we're done with this place. Let's go and see if we can get something inside Meteor Falls as well. Oh, TM05. What's that one going to contain? I can hardly contain my excitement. He says it has charm, but I don't think it's going to actually be charm. Okay, it's actually charm. Never mind. All right, let's go down and we'll kill this guy. Yeah. A lot of these trainers are kind of under leveled, but... Our team's really not overleveled. We just were properly leveled for the gym. And then all these trainers are just really easy. The berry crush machine. Don't crush my berries. Lynette's house. Ew. All right, you know what? We'll go talk to her. Whatever. Hey, Lynette. Your place looks a lot like my office. Why does she have six computers? There's a computer monitor facing a wall. How are you going to use that, crud? All right, we got the low tad doll. It might be low tad, but it's high rad. Oh my gosh, dude. I wish we could catch that, but we can't. Rare candy, dude. Our second rare candy in one day. Thanks, Xbox. This is why we keep you around, man. Okay, let's keep going. We're almost at Meteor Falls here. Wait, did that guy just yodel at me? Yodel a hi who? Meteor Falls. We can capture whatever this is. What is it, dude? Got ourselves. Hey, all right, dude. We got a Politoed. This guy is level 18. He goes for Fissure, but Fissure cannot hit if we're higher level than him, which we are. So kind of scary, but it can't hit us. We're fine. We've only had one busted ball for the entire day. I don't think this guy is going to give us any problems here. Ball. Oh my gosh, not even a wiggle. Hello. And got it. There we go, dude. So what do we name Politoed? There we go. Max Potion. Oh, dude, we got the Sour Patch Kids. Oh my gosh, the blue Sour Patch Kids are here. I don't think there's any other color teams. I don't think there's going to be a green one, even though this is Pokemon Emerald. What would you even call a green team? Blue is Aqua. Green is Magma. No, blue is Aqua. Red is Magma. So I guess green would have to be snot. Gosh dang it, Archie. Get out of here, man. With your stinking chest pixels. Oh my gosh, dude. Man, why did we get Politoed when we could have had an Entei? Gosh dang it, man. First we find a Mewtwo that we can't catch. Now we find an Entei we can't catch. 
Ah, oh, he's got a starfish face. All right, we gotta run, guys. We have to. Uh, I think we have to go down this. I could jump down, or I could just take the stairs. Item? <laughs> no item here. So let's continue downwards. Oh my gosh, game, just let me walk. Oh my, Entei, leave me alone. I don't even want you, Entei. You're stinking donuts around your legs. Oh my gosh, what? What? Another one? So can I split my experience three different ways now? What the crud? All right. I don't think I've ever had two experience shares before in Pokemon Emerald. Oh my. He's back. He's level 18. He might have Metronome. I'm gonna Ice Beam on Salamence. We're gonna go ahead and Leech Seed on Kyogre. Do not have Metronome. Maybe they learn Metronome at 19 and not 18. Maybe. Salamence goes down, no problem. They do have metronome, no explosion. Sheer cold, that's fine. That's fine, it can only hit if, we're, uh, if they're higher level than us, which they're not. I'm gonna go and I guess just do Needle Arm and maybe I'll do uh, Pedal Dance here. I'm guessing this will do some pretty big damage, even though they are a special tank. Oh my gosh, that's big damage. Okay, they go for metronome, something bad, bad move, belly drum. Well, he can't even use it because that requires you to use lots of HP. So down goes Kyogre, no problem. Metronome is always scary, but I guess this time it worked out fine. Bunwiz 29, kind of a weird spot to stop the episodes, but I think we're gonna wrap it up here for today. We'll come back next time. We're gonna go to Mount Chimney, or Mr. Chimney, whatever it is. We're gonna go and defeat Maxi. We're gonna get to Lava Ridge, do a gym battle, and then we're gonna go back to Petalburg and do another gym battle probably. So next episode is gonna be absolutely ridiculous. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Take care.